streaming. I hit the button. Now the question is, does the button come alive? Hmm. Oh, it says I am. Kind of, maybe, sort of. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mark, the guy at play. How are you guys doing today? Once again, we are back in Fallout 4 here. Something you recommend? Beers, fine. Now there's a ringing endorsement. Isn't it though? You hear about that farm run by ghouls? Isn't that something? You came to visit. I, I did. I almost thought you wouldn't. Why? Hey, now that you're back here in Sanctuary, how would you like a job? A job? For, for me? Really? Yes. Yeah. What do you say? Want to work for me? Uh... You're gonna keep him in Sanctuary House. Yes! Oh my god, this... This is the best thing to happen to me since... The worst thing to happen to me. <laughs> okay. Alright, Piper. I'm sorry. I, I, I wouldn't be very good company right now. Um... Kinda thinking I might want Nick. What are we gonna up and do? Let's see here. Hope you enjoy ah, definitely not taking Nick to the fridge one. Let's see. I'll get the brewing machine. Haven't done that, so we'll do. Go get the brewing machine. It was part of the good mayor thing. And we were gonna go get the uh like this. Commonwealth weapons. Oh, where are you? It's a dangerous world out there. Protect yourself. Yeah, we'll just go to Bunker Hill and call it good and work our way down there. See what kind of mischief we can cause today. Sultan Robot was constructed by Roboco and sold to the U.S. military as a frontline wartime combatant. The fast is diddly close range and employs a devastating laser at a distance. Some units can even deploy stealth technology. Beware of the claws of poisonous stinger. Oh, really? I just wanted to scratch it behind the scale. <laughs> Yeah, you guys are so picky. That's one way to keep out uninvited guests. By what? Closing the doors? I'm not even going in. You've been here? You should have been here. Uh, let's see here. We are headed towards... No, no. Uh, here, ultimately. Right across the bridge. Personally, I would not live under the underpass because it's been 200 years since it's been maintained, blown up. Like this section, it's like held here and held there. This thing just seems like it wants to come crashing down. I'm just saying. Wouldn't make a residency here. Careful. And this was last radius, huh? That was a personality by Johnny Mercer. 
So I have a radio on. Go. I gotta listen to Silver Shroud. Yeah, yeah, okay. Something interesting. Into the robot's den. Oof, sounds scary. That's all of them. Fat fees, mob bots have been sent back to the mechanical hell that spawned them. Yes, my caller and companion. And no, robotic hell spawn they were. But not fat fees. For he himself presented the facts. Someone else is actually the master of it all. Mistress of Mysteries, you and I have battled Boston's Rogues Gallery for years. Is it just me or does this place like feel empty? Someone new. Certainly. But which criminal culprit has the technological know-how to construct such clockwork calamities? I don't You don't know anything. Yeah, right. I do see. And I'll tell you to on one condition. By the shadowed streets of Southie, one of the mob bots' heads is still talking. You darn right I am. I can't feel my legs because you shot me up on shroud. But I still got my kisses. Yeah, at least we're not entirely alone. Some leg. Yeah, sounded like they're still shooting at us. They are. Mistress of mystery. Oh, good, good. That's cheese, if I ever heard.
exciting episode of The Silver Shroud. You've been listening to Galaxy News Radio, a wholly owned subsidiary of Galaxy News Network. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows. All right. <clears throat> That's more or less just obnoxious in there. Shamrock Tap House. I am looking for something specific out of this place, so with any luck, we shall find it. Never knew you could disarm those. Yeah, it is. Isn't that uh, kind of how that normally works out? Hmm. Nothing there now. What do you think? I don't know. I thought that was adorable. Yeah, you're probably right. Gotta cut down on the jet, I guess. Someone there? <laughs> what the hell was that? I swear I must have gone crazy. <laughs> Who's there? Just going to waste otherwise. The jet will make you jittery. Who's out there? Guess they were right. <laughs> Nothing. Just to show you what looks that way. Huh? <laughs> there you are, you little oh, bastard! Come on! I've done this hundreds of times! Covering fire! Me too. Yeah, I think I'm going to win it. You got to reload sometime, asshole. I already did actually. But thanks for your interest. But I won't. Ah, shove. Got it. Seven, that's it. Alrighty. You're still alive? Christ. Yeah, I'm still creeping around here. Spirit act, huh? Couldn't part with anything, could they? When you turn up, you're dead. No sign of them now. You sure manage to find your fair share of trouble, don't you? I'm pretty good at that. I like Matt. The 
That's it. This is bullshit. Sometimes. Toasty down there now. Hey, you still there? I can barely see in here. Oh, it's because it was on fire when you were walking around in it. Okay. Bludgeoned. Bludgeoned has one. Won't be that. Uh, Alright, <clears throat> so let's see what we got here. Soldiers and bludgeon. Have one. Wouldn't be that, because the E on the end takes that out of the container. String and bludgeon has what? Nothing in common. Sleeping! That's the L. Yes. Okay. Unknown. Hardware detected. 
Auxiliary BIOS detected. Flashing operational subroutines. Micro brewers operational. Internal bottling mechanism operational. Output dispensary operational. Detecting brewing subroutines. Hollow tape detected for women. Fail ale. Start up sequence complete. Dispensing sample for approval by technician. How would you describe the testing sample provided? Cold and refreshing. <sighs> cold and refreshing. Do you know how long it's been since I had cold beer? Very good. I appear to be operating at an optimal level. Shall we commence delivery to the Hotel Rexford? Uh, um, I am very tempted to keep you, but I yeah, agreed. Sure. Beginning transit operations to Hotel Rexford. Oh, I love that. I definitely love that. That's cool. Tempted. No. Well, it doesn't look like you got hit by any of the knife throwing contests, but you don't appear to be alive. Cold. The fact that they had that. Oh, hello. In this door, go out this door. Find the silver shroud. I am seriously tempted to 
Yeah. It's just like running through the minefield, it's a thing. Apparently that's not healthy. I lose a leg that way. I was stuck against something. <laughs> I kept pressing back and I was not going back any further. Totally don't approve of that. If I take a step back, I'd like to go back. the way to go. There we go. Um... Done exploding over here. 
I'm still trying to kill this idiot. Let's increase damage. Night, less during the day. Why would you be holding that? Because I'm carrying too much. Carrying a rocket launcher for crying out loud again, aren't I? And it only weighs 21. Does increase on standard 950. It's a special one. I want to drop that. We'll drop this though. Well, that won't do. Alright, Piper, where are you at? Yo, psst. help yourself. I'd love to give you some stuff. Mostly a rocket launcher I'm not gonna use. I wonder. We do pick up all sorts of stuff. It's helpful stuff, but yeah. I turned around, pulled the trigger, and it didn't even fire, and I was eaten alive, eaten alive. I must be tasty. <laughs> really? I'm gonna do this again? No, you don't really need to. We can just let him do his thing. He's gonna go there anyway. I only got viable blood samples. We did level up. Can't do that yet. Can't do that yet. Hmm.
I'm gonna make a boom boom. boom, boom, boom. Um, I'm gonna let him do his thing. He's gonna go all the way back there. So we're gonna close one on Boston on the Oils Club combat. We're going there now. Mostly so I don't have to figure out the streets of Boston Commons. Holy crap, I get lost. Then I get blocked and I can't go anywhere. It's kind of frustrating, a little annoying. It's a bit of a thing. Doesn't this thing actually do 50% more towards... I think that's what it was, right? You see any back issues of Grognak the Barbarian? I could use them. Now or they get to Oven myth, huh? I need an oven mint. Grognak the Barbarian, huh? I like the fact that there's a key on it. <gasps> Ooh. There we go. Permanently gain 1% chance of avoiding all damage from an attack. Sweet. I'm cool with that. Here's Apparently I need some money. Oh, they'll probably come back. That's what they do. They didn't really leave, you know. Huh. Too much. I always end up carrying too much. Why is that? Piper, where are you at? How do you find anything in here?
big ball, apparently. Hey. Shoot. Sure. Take a peek. Probably wouldn't want me Maybe to do that. New frontier of foul. Hey. Point the Alright, head on up and see what we see. Thinking we want to be a little more silent though. Trying to be quiet here, guys. You're just all up in my face. That's what that is. Yeah, it doesn't do me any good for healing. Proper darken area. Oh, I know why. He doesn't have 
suppressed gun. She's uh, attracting attention, regardless. All right, all right, go back to this guy then. Terminal, huh? See what the writers are writing. Wall screen, I agree. Hands are important, but the Silver Shroud's members outside of the bus are well, not ideal. Dad and his family, I promise you. Funny, funny, but again, over this. Hmm. Yesterday. And after sitting around on their tushes. Shakespeare TV, alright? I know you don't like the new monkey, but uh, with this loves it. Hmm. Sounds like uh, standard uh, writer issues. Do it faster, do it cheaper, stop delaying. to 45 to kill a cockroach. sort of thing to say, I guess. Ah, I tried stalling her, but things are smiling out her agents as every time I fall for a derby and good cause. Still on board, she loves the script, she especially loves the outfit. You got the shots, sorry. Care with her doing the back I'm clad in box apartment. Come to my attention. Uh, oh. oh, don't do that. I'm reading. Silver Shroud drama continues. 
Apparently. Uh, all right, Mr. Glowy. You know, you can just go up there and tilt him in the head now, right? Hell yeah. Ragnar costume. Strength wear, damn it, really sweet. You've not killed him yet. He's still standing for crying out loud. Come on, get to it, Piper. Body out of lights, lights control, video controls, uh, I don't think I really want to do anything. Just playing with the set, it's gonna be fun. Cameras are down. And you still your machine go faster. I think we've gotten to a point in the game where it has to start thinking about stuff. Really shouldn't be thinking this long though. That's a little long. Doesn't seem like a great place to linger, Blue. Doesn't seem like a bad place to linger. Just said we could come up here. It didn't say why we would be up here. Easier way out, maybe? Going through the hole. Oh, that tickles. Alright, so... Yeah, let's head there. Oh, okay, well, I'll do that because really, you know, I'm thinking I might just make a rule. Traveling in the Boston Commons area outside of searching for something, I might have to just do that because it's, 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 it's a mess.
<sighs> hey, buddy. Engaging compliment subroutine. Looking good. <laughs> All right, let's go give the shroud to Crazy Town. Probably just gonna get himself into trouble. Would be my bet anyway. Hey, Mr. Shroud, talk to I got guy. your costume, Kent. And some other goodies you might like. There she is. Pretty as the posters. The Silver Shroud costume herself. And memorabilia, too? You're something else. Together with my gun, everything's all set. Uh. What's what are you plan? planning next? I'm still working that out. Some details I want to run by you. Well, after you give me the costume, that is. Yeah. Here you go. Here's the costume. After all these years, the Silver Shroud is born again. But there's just one problem. I'm just not Silver Shroud material. I could be Rhett Reinhardt or, or his butler, Jarvie Blake. But the Shroud is strong, capable. Believe in yourself. Come on. Don't sell yourself short. I got a better idea who should wear it. You up for being the Silver Shroud? You already got your own origin story and everything. Good, man. What with the cryo vault and all? Hmm. Why me? Why me? You helped me out when everyone else just laughed at me. And you're from the olden days, just like me. You know how much things have fallen? How much we gotta fight for? True. To make the place better? So you win? Okay. Looks like I get to be the Shroud. The costume and gun are yours. So you patrol good neighbor's streets, and I'll call in any crimes on my radio station. Okay. Here's some calling cards, I guess. When you dispatch justice, leave them behind. That way, everyone knows the Silver Shroud has returned. Time to fight crime! Uh... Okay... Silver Shroud Armor, Silver Shroud Hat. Now uh, that's significantly dropping all my uh, stuff. I have a feeling he's going to ask me to do that now. Uh, Is it always wrong side of the tracks? Can it ever be the right side of the tracks? Calling all Silver Shroud fans. A once in a lifetime announcement. The Silver Shroud returns and he's gonna clean up the streets. Everyone heard how Wayne Delancey murdered Miss Selmy and her kid over a few lousy caps. Death is coming for you, Wayne. Galaxy! Radio. Um. When evil walks 
the streets of Boston. One man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, the mystery of Mayor Murphy. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode in the parlor of Greetings, Mr. new friends. I am the Franken. What the heck is this thing? You can it's that brewing machine I was telling buddy. you about. I am here to provide entertainment oh, and man. I That's awesome. I'm going to scroll Fine, my right, Just get it set up over at the bar and out of my doorway. Brain. Commencing normal Ecstasy. operations. This hey, thanks for your help. Buddy here dead. is even better than I was hoping oh, for. Mysteries. Here's your money. Shh. Be still, sweet trout. I removed that scumbag slug, but you're sick with fever and still suffering. Mistress of Mysteries, no, I'm all right. But the mayor, Fat Fatty, we stumbled upon a most sinister plot, old friend. Ha! No, dear heart. The shroud stumbled. The mistress maneuvered. I knew of the mayor's misdeeds for many days. Okay. I followed him to that fateful meeting with Fat Faith. I was about to. Attention! Silver Shroud and Mistress of Mystery! This is Chief Corcoran of the Boston Police Department! <coughs> we know you're in there! You are both wanted in connection with the murder of Mayor Murphy! Come out with your hands up! It would seem that our leaving the scene of the Scale slaughter was terribly timed. Incurring the wrath of Boston's finest is an unfortunate and unexpected annoyance. Unexpected by What's with the us? fancy duds? Looks but expensive. Might be I found pain. a new friend. Ah, I'm starting to to see into his twisted plan. Ah, damn this gunshot. Rumor is you killed Miss Selmy. That true? Sell me? Yeah, I killed the bitch. And her wealth, too. Shouldn't have bothered they barely had two caps between them. Excuse my assumption that even the most astute attorney couldn't help us now. Your crimes have gone unpunished for too long. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? Well, nothing a few bullets won't cure. You mess with me, you're dead. <laughs> Okay. Mistress of Mystery, hands up for order of the Boston Police. Chief Gorgon, I am Death's Shroud, but you <laughs> are undeserving of my care and justice. Think of my mercy. Stop or we'll shoot. Then open fire. I can carry something you can me to. Where did this weapon come from? I'm not taking anything. Wait, it's the armor. Chief, they ain't here. They're gone. They sleep a common card. They that officer leave with friend of the show. Jerry is here. Is this thing on? Hello. Hello. It's on. We're recording in here. Heard what you did. Oh, man. Saved that Rex Goodman from the super mutants. Yes, not everyone appreciates the bard. Am I right? Oh, indeed. Great. Great. The Silver Shrouds dispatched justice already. Miss Selmy has been avenged. No Shed use. Shroud off Wayne? Wait, so this guy's actually for real? Oh, you better believe it. So, Jerry, go on. Tell the listeners about what we're talking about. Right. So, AJ, you know the chem dealer by Bobby's. He's doing good for himself. Says he's got a whole new market. Kids. Even with his garbage chems, he's just raking in the caps. 
You hear that? Sounds like the Silver Shroud has another bad guy to deal with. Uh, why? This Shroud guy, he's gonna muscle in on the chem trade now? No. He's gonna do something about it. AJ's selling the kids. And his chems have killed people. And? I don't get it. We can't let AJ kill kids. Whatever. Ah, uh, true. Can't let him kill kids. It's the thing. Ah. Uh. I have a feeling this is not going to end well for everyone. Uh. See them. Nah, relax, boy. Huh. She's all right. Ain't you all right, uh, <clears throat> Cindy? Hey, look at the clown. Yeah. This is my it's turf candy. clown. And yeah. And I don't appreciate right. what you call I'm them. I'm just a young, dumb girl in love with a handsome, hmm. dangerous man. Um, you, AJ, the dealer who sells to children. Yeah, that's me. I'm a entrepreneur. I'm making a new market. Chems for kids, I call it. Cherry flavored jets, bubblegum mentats. Them Diamond City kids just eat them up. <sighs> Peddling poison to kids, are we? Today, you face the Silver Shroud. Uh, <laughs> who you say? Oh, for Christ's sake. He can't put you up to this. He keeps moaning about the poor little kids. What the hell, right? Tell you what, I'll pay you, let's say, 50 caps just to shut up about it. <laughs> and uh, maybe get Kent off my back, all right? Uh... Stop selling to children, a miscreant, or face my wrath. Board up the windows because we're putting you out of business. Screw you. Waste the free. <laughs> All right, bodyguard, headshot. <laughs> Everyone's shooting at me. What's up with that? Fuck with White Chapel Charlie. When evil walks the streets of Boston, <clears throat> one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode Into the Robot's Den. Hancock says newcomers are welcome in the third rail. Go on in. That's all of them. Fat fees, mob bots have been sent back to the mechanical hell. Let's spawn them. Yes, my choleric companion. 
And no, is that a silver shroud costume? <laughs> hey, ain't no judgments, but ain't that a kid's show? Someone mm. else is actually Charlie. My way for Ryan customers. You look like one of them wankers from the posters. Dearest mysteries of mysteries, you and I have battled Boston's rogues gallery. Mm. You look upon the silver shroud. I seek a miscreant named Kendra. Shroud? Kendra is not one to be trifled with. People associated with her have a habit of being found face down in a ditch. You're set on meeting her. For a fee, it can be arranged. It is not wise to stand between the Silver Shroud and righteous justice. Justice? Uh, you mean to end her? In that case, a flat's just south of good neighbor. Water Street Apartments. Look out for the blighter she's got with her. Nasty piece of business, that. Good luck. To find you in a dump you like this, I was wondering how long it would take your bloodhounds to track you down, Winlock. For almost three fun. months. Tell me you're getting rusty. Should we take this outside? It ain't like that. I'm just here to deliver a message. In case you forgot, I left the gunners for good. Yeah, I heard. But you're still taking jobs in the Commonwealth. That isn't going to work for us. I don't take orders from you. Not anymore. So why don't you take your girlfriend and walk out of here while you still can? What? Winlock, tell me we don't have to listen to this shit. Listen up, McCready. The only reason we haven't filled your body full of bullets is that we don't want a war with Good Neighbor. See, we respect other people's boundaries. We know how to play the game. It's something you never learned. Glad to have disappointed you. <laughs> you can play the tough guy all you want. But if we hear you're still operating inside gunner territory, all bets are off. You got that? You finished? Yeah. We're finished. Come on, Barnes. Hmm. Making friends, I see. Look, pal. If you're preaching about the Atom or looking for a friend, you've got the wrong guy. If you need a hired gun, then maybe we can talk. Hmm. Maybe. Why don't you tell me who those guys were first? A couple of morons looking to climb the ladder of success by stepping on everyone else on the way up. Shouldn't be surprised, though. It's how it goes when you run with the Gunners. Never heard of the Gunners. Who are they? They're one of the biggest gangs in the Commonwealth. Got a rep for being crazy. You know, so tightly wound, you think they were a cult or something? Stuck with them for a while because the money was good, but they never fit in. That's why I made a clean break and started flying solo. Now what about you? How do I know I won't end up with a bullet in my back? Hmm. Are you always this suspicious? Hey, you approached me. And frankly, I'm taking a huge risk being out here in the Commonwealth in the first place. So I'm not about to leave anything in chance. Which brings me back to my original question. Can I trust you? Hold on. What kind of risk are you talking about? I already told you way too much. I need to learn to keep my big mouth shut. Look, I'm tired of playing 20 questions. So I'll cut you a deal right now. 250 caps. Up front. And there's no room for bargaining. What do you say? Hmm. 
150. I'll say that. Now you're speaking my language. All right, boss. You got yourself an extra gun. Lead on. Then Piper back to. Hmm. Thanks, Piper. So. Huh? Don't have no handouts. Nothing says welcome like the stench of urine-soaked garbage. Seems to be the standard uh, stuff around here. Uh... Little Kendra. Need to know where Kendra's at to be able to kill her. Not too far. Hmm. What a shot he is. I have a feeling because it's out of good neighbor. I'm gonna take a mob. That's my bet, anyway. Yeah, he ducked. Damn. Now he's just starting to have fun. Rats are making me feel sick in my stomach. Can't just leave a toy like that laying around. Although we probably should have.
I don't do machine gun. But then. Okay. Grady, what are you doing? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, give me a minute. I got a quick bye and I'll be right back. This is pretty much a dead end. I was thinking... Might have been a good place to get into some apartments or something like that. I see a subfloor that I can go through. Well, this isn't good. Our stuff. that. Maybe he'll show up in this. Going down. Yo, psst. Yeah, sure. I'll trade with you. Uh, I have another weapon for you, you might like.
Considering the arena, I am thinking I want my normal defensive. Because we come down an elevator. Hmm, should have moved into the room. Going down. Huh? Hey. Not what I wanted. Probably not right now. No sign of him now. What the fuck was that? Uh, come on. There you go. Damn. I was just starting to have fun. Hmm. 
kind of greedy. What do you want? Let's talk armor, shall we? Pick up. Found one. Grab that. up another weapon, didn't I? First one combat rifle. Yeah. Hey! What? Not the one I've got. Uh. <laughs> ah, the blinding light. You must be Kendra. And you, you're the crazy one in the costume. Wayne hmm. Delancey's killer. You have no idea who you're dealing with. I do so like it when the little bug crawls willingly into the spider's webs. Hmm. Wayne deserved it. Wayne got what was coming to him. And so shall you. Wayne. Okay. We're just gonna get right to it, huh? Alright. I'm fine with that. We'll hit that. We'll hit that. First boom boom. <clears throat> ah. Any questions? Uh, considering how much other stuff you have in here that would have been good.
Yeah, what is it? All right. Well, I suppose we can leave from here. All right. Into the financial district we go. Yeah, skulls above head, people said bad. <laughs> Haven't seen one of those in a while. Wow. Come out and uh, start getting shot at. Eyes on my back. <sighs> Holy crap. He's actually got an advantage shot, too. Now that's what I call a confirmed kill. I would agree. In the grand scheme of things, ow. Go up here and see what we got. I need to go back to good neighbor at this point if I'm reserving. Interesting. Yes.
Did I not? I didn't put the card down. Ugh. I didn't put the card down. Or did I? Another special update. No, it wasn't Bobby No Nose who offed AJ and his goons. It was the Silver Shroud. See his calling card if you don't believe me. Now's our time, listeners. Justice is coming, a good neighbor. You'll see. Looks like another we got headline. another freak just Hancock won't fit anywhere else. a special else. meeting with our hero, the Silver Shroud. Whatever it's about, be careful, Shroud. We're all with you. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Hmm. Today's episode, The Mechanist Unmasked. I've seen a lot of crazy Pit stuff. Of fire. Reminds me of the shit against the yeah, how's a... Chelsea Mingler. Uh, it's not a crashed flying ship. So. I'm actually not too surprised. Not what I want to do. <laughs> Malignant, am I? No, mistress of mystery. What you mistake for evil is hmm. actually... Wonder. Hancock gonna be pissed. Probably gonna know who I am. Not like this uh, costume. I would say not. understand the folly of human kind. Here, I'm gonna pause that while I talk to him. A new player and good neighbor. Hello, little pawn. Welcome to our fun and games. Hmm. Guess what someone tells me. Some costume freak is operating in Good Neighbor. And the kicker is, it ain't me. How should I feel about this? Uh... Well, let's see here. You should actually like it. Have I crossed the line? I don't know. Let's recap. You've been busy scaring people, bashing in a few faces. I respect that, so far. But I gotta ask, one freak to another, why the getup? Does it matter? Does it matter? Yeah, it really doesn't, but in a burg full of weird, you stand out. And that ain't easy, man. The lowlifes you took out all belong to the same asshole. And that asshole's planning some old-fashioned revenge on you. You dig? Fortunate for you. I want Sinjin to take a dirt nap. He's taken two bit raider outfits and made them scary. Small fish now, but if left alone. What do you know about him? Leveled some farms, napalmed his own men and a couple enemies. But besides his dark deeds, nobody knows nothing. If he ain't dealt with now, in a couple of years, it may take an army to end him. Hmm. Why are you telling me this? If I get involved, it gets complicated. But you, nobody knows who the hell you are. Just some lunatic taking out trash. And if you buy it, none of this comes back to me. Maybe I'll help. 
Got a lead on two of his own. Smiling Kate and Northy. Smiley is gathering a posse to take you out. And Northy is just running scared. Hired himself some goons and is holing up in prospect. Just keep piling those body bags up until you find the location of the big guy himself. You don't know where Sinjin is? No one does. He's a behind the scenes kind of guy. But you keep poking his people with a machine gun, and he'll come out of hiding. Huh. Sinjin thinks he's above judgment, but no one is safe from the Silver, Silver Shroud. Shroud. Don't get killed. <laughs> you deal with Sinjin, and I'm inclined to show you some gratitude. You feel me? I can do that. Uh, sure. Lovely party you have here. Let's go. So the real question is, where do I find more body count? Still Northy, okay. Question is, where are North? Your buddy McCready's got a rep here in good neighbor. Bad attitude. Bad attitude, good aim. Well, I'm okay with the attitude I can deal with. Good aim is always helpful. Yeah, mostly because... Outside of dog meat, I would say there's limiting interest. <sighs> the hell is that? That's this thing. Got him in the head. Okay. What did I? Oh. Uh. Bunker Hill. Monument here is a joke compared to the one in downtown Washington. This would be a great spot to bunker down. Hmm. 
Now, what do you say we go over here and uh, say hi? So glad you could all come out and play. And boy, do we just have the best little chew toy to sink our teeth into. The legendary Silver Shroud. Sure, the Shroud's already killed some of our best, but so what? That just makes the bounty even juicier. Pack your gear, because we're going to go murdering soon! If it isn't the boy behind the costume. Mm, you've been really naughty, Mr. Shroud. Making all my friends so nervous with your calling cards. <laughs> Taking out Sinjin's favorite toy soldiers. But now it's time to rip your goddamned heart out! I think so. I think I'm gonna do the ripping of the heart out. Kind of thing. Well, we're splitting all that, right? Well, kinda, sorta, anyway. Hmm. Looks like you do not have a left arm. I have a left arm. Right arm. Leg, long drawn, so. Oh. That's that one. Where's the other one? Way over there. Let's take the scenic route this time. Well, that's probably not. Yeah, just need to go around these guys. Well, I would think you might be a little impressed. Those were pretty good shots. Yeah, I even sat one down on a park bench over here.
further. Extreme return. few hold that thought we have a weapon for that what was seven I think I put it as They're already all dead. Um, no thanks to you. Apparently not all of them. Mercury. Get our head all the way up. Gonna have to start doing something about those. <laughs> okay, time to move over here. Found them. <laughs> uh, now it's a matter of uh, just killing them. Uh, you can't change weapons for that. that gun? Did I give Did I give McCready that gun? If I gave him that gun, I'm going to be a little pissed off at myself. Uh, <clears throat> seven. <clears throat> Moving. Where are you? I don't see anyone. There we are. Yeah, do you feel that? I do. We 
There's something else around here. Something else going on. Nice. Well, do you like some duct tape and jet? Alright, we'll take all of that stuff. Oh shit. Don't know where that came from, but. Who's nuking the roof? came at us in a lot of different ways, but it was a rather direct one. Wasn't healthy. Okay. There's bodies for clues. Well, actually, let's go over here and put the body to rest, because I think we're going to... That's a bodyguard. That's a bodyguard. So these are all bodyguards. Where's the actual... Okay, so did I already pilfer it? Hmm. I don't know. A little.
Well, that tickles. Stairs. I think I just found your left leg. Oh. Need something? Let's find the silver shrouds. So take a look at that. Delancey are six feet under. The Silver Shroud claim the hits. Northy, Sinjin wants you to keep up the recruiting efforts. We need more warm bodies after we deal with the costume. And don't worry, Kate's gathering a bunch of meatheads to take the Shroud out. The boss ain't happy. Now's not a time for failure. He's getting personally involved. He's gonna pay the Shroud's flunky friend a special visit in Good Neighbor. After he's done with that, he'll check in. He'll expect results. Well, that's problematic. Uh, good neighbor. Still dressed as a silver shroud. Well, I take it things went poorly. I see a bunch of blood, so there's that. Ah. Oh, it's you. Oh, sugar. I told Kent all that hero stuff was going to get you both killed. I'm still oh, standing. God. Oh, God. Uh, where's Kent? What happened to Kent? Where is he? They. They took him. Raiders. Nothing but bloodlust in their eyes. We. We couldn't stop them. When they took him away, they left you a message. Just listen to Kent's radio station. It keeps playing it over and over again. Yes. If you want to see your friend alive, Shroud, meet me at Milton General Hospital. General Hospital, huh? Be a good place for you. After I poke a bunch of holes on you. That's what I'm thinking anyway. Don't do it, Shroud. It's a trap. Save yourself. Nope. Definitely not gonna ah. do it. Oh. oh my god. Do it, Shroud. Do it. Oh, I need... ah. Take 
Dog Shroud. Don't keep me waiting. We got business that needs finishing. Indeed. Here's a Silver Shroud update. In case you missed. Hmm. Well, I suppose it was bound to happen. Someone us defended he was, after all, in you know, good neighbor on his own in a memory den. It's not like he was in the castle broadcasting data. She won't be. What? Oh, God, what's happening? Mm. On your knees, dirtbag. What? What are you doing? What? Ah! Sinjin, all clear. Supposed to meet you at a hospital? So you must be the Silver Shroud's little friend. Yes. If you want to see your friend alive, Shroud, meet me at Milton General Hospital. That's a little out of the way. Make a planes, we'll have to go. Just more bullets. Always need more bullets. Oh, come on, we're here. Don't tell me you actually believe that buried treasure nonsense. Um, actually, the nonsense is uh, somewhat on the real side. Uh, right over there. While we're here... Yeah, we only got one way into this place. It's kind of the benefit of what it is. From up here, you get shot from all sorts of directions. Where are you at? There you are. Hey. Well. Uh. Where is the one I do? Are we still in there?
Oh. Go more junk. Uh, let's see here. Getting rid of the silver. Need the black vest and flags. Okay. Mm. Good weather to go hunting. I'll be back. I gotta take care of something first. Anything I can do to help? Uh, well. I agree. Sometimes it's annoying. Find anything useful on them? Just the normal everyday fun. Where is that? Way over there. Brotherhood. Hey guys. That's a high school. That is not what I want. That looks like a hospital that's kind of a thing. Nothing. You see nothing, you hear nothing, I go inside. Yeah, hang out here while you explore the building. No? You're like just hanging out in the lobby, huh? Who? Nothing there now. What do you think? Well, found someone that shot back, see how he is. Starting to have fun. Come 
Armored armor, left arm. Left leg. Get your left leg. Right, through this left mess. Leg. Go right ahead. Yeah. Playing games with me, huh? Uh, you know, nothing better to do, but you yeah. know. Show your face. Come on, I dare you. Didn't expect the elevator to actually work. Where I'm supposed to be, yeah. Elevator it is, I guess. Yo, Psst. what's up? Put your butt in here, so you can go up. Or I guess down. <laughs> Basement. A little bit more on loud. Sweet. Hey, you teach me that sometime. Eh, hey, you think you want to know it, huh? Oh, another one. Got it. Eh, uh, an automatic thing, though. If she goes through bullets like nothing else, she doesn't run out. I think that one, I think. Didn't end well for him.
Bone saw. I needed a bone saw. Okay. Creedy, where are you at? Supposed to be a port here. Or at least that would be helpful. Clear the other ones. Clear the other hall. Oh, we do love a microscope. Oh, it's just a room with impacts. Up a stairwell I'll go. Stick your head out. Hey, my first gunfight, rookie. Oh. Not mine either. Think you can win this, huh? Maybe. Who knows? Got bodies in the way, though. to be locked, you know, no one trusted anyone. See how they are. Yes. What a residence lack. Can't find them, damn it. Can't take much more. What the hell was that? I'd like to know what you just did. Looked like it came from underneath, so I suppose we'll go down the hall. Down the hall we go. What the fuck was that? Hey, back time, bogeyman. Uh, uh, 
you doing sleeping on the job? Lock, huh? Sweet. That old stuff worth anything? Well, some of it is. out of here. Now would be good. Bad. Hitting you in the head for crying out loud. Always a dead end, right? Yeah, go down the elevator or over here, I guess. Come on, man. Get your butt up here. Or down here, I guess. Okay, you want to talk? We'll Let's talk. Say it again. Hold, assholes. Anyone turns heel, I'm coming for you and your family. And you, Shroud. You step any closer, and we get to see what's inside Ken's head. Well, that would just be rude. Okay. Uh, let's see here. What do you want? What do you want, Sinjin? We'll get to that. Some hmm. of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know you're human. And you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? Yeah, pretty much. Um... Friends, aren't Friends frequent. don't make you weak. They make you strong. I can play you like a chump because you care about a weakling like this. And you think that's strength? So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to good neighbor. Oh, kill every last worthless bastard there and burn the whole thing down. No one screws with Sinjin. Ah... <sighs> I am the instrument of justice, and I cannot fall. Death has come for you, evildoer, and I am its shroud. Stop talking like that. It is the shroud. It really is. Screw this. Coach. Okay, first and foremost, I need to help Kent. 
means I need to kill the idiot. So, I'm gonna go with that. Need some more on that real soon. Yeah, no. Uh, I want to see if I can save Kent. do this. Should I just take it and go at it? I'd say speak as a shroud. You yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know you're human. And you're weak. I am human. You came here and for what? I'm far from weak. You little sidekick. Uh... I have cut a path through all your thugs. Who can truly say I'm not the Shroud? Don't listen, man. He's a phony. So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to Good Neighbor. And kill every last worthless <laughs> bastard there. And burn the whole thing down. No one. Screws with Sinjin. I am the instrument of justice, and I cannot fall. Death has come for you, evildoer, and I am its shroud. Stop talking like that. It is the shroud. It really is. Screw this. Coach. Uh Take a jet. That didn't work. Uh, let's try this again. I really want to save him. It's like, cool. Um, I'm just going to go and see if this works. Bigger jet. Weapon. Where's my bang bang? If we can't do it that way, we have to do it the other. All I gotta do is pull the trigger. Yeah, I know. That's the problem. You shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know you're human and you're weak. You came here and for what? Your little sidekick? Uh... 
friends don't make you weak. They make you strong. I can play you like a chump because you care about a weakling like this. And you think that's strength? So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to good neighbor and kill every last worthless bastard there and burn the whole thing down. No one screws with Sinjin. <sighs> Leave Kent out of this. I'm the one you want. Looks like it's my lucky day, because I'm getting both of you. Yeah, that didn't do it. I don't know if it's the... Uh... Charisma issues I've got, or what? Do the threatening end of things and go from there. All I gotta do is pull the trigger. Yeah, me too, really. You shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers are you and I know. You're human. And you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? Uh So you're the strong one? Yeah. Because I don't give a damn about anyone or anything. There's nothing I wouldn't do to win. So what's going to happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're going to shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's <sighs> going to be left but paste. Then I'm going to good neighbor kill every last worthless bastard there and burn the whole thing down no one screws with Sinjin <sighs> you know what would really get to Kent killing his friend his hero right in front of him nice try say good night Kent Ah, uh, it didn't work. He's gonna end up dead because he literally does take one, one shot to the head, and you know the show is pretty much over for the end. Pull the trigger. Don't do anything rash, Sinjin. Rash. Rash. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know you're human. And you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? Uh Friends don't make you weak. They make you strong. I can play you like a chump because you care about a weakling like this. And you think that's strength? So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then I'm going to good neighbor and kill every well, last worthless bastard the whole thing, there didn't it? and burn the whole thing down. No one screws with Sinjin. Ah. <sighs> I am the instrument of justice, and I cannot fall. Death has come for you, evildoer, and I am its shroud. Stop talking like that. It is the shroud. It really is. Screw this. Coach. Co He's already dead. Coach. I don't really see how I'm going to save him, just saying. Hmm. <sighs> so 
speak as a you child. shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin, and you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know you're human and you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? <sighs> I have cut a path through all your thugs. Who can truly say I'm not the Shroud? Don't listen, man. He's a phony. So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. <sighs> Nothing's gonna yeah, be left. Probably are. Paste. Then, I'm going to good neighbor. And kill every last worthless bastard there. And burn the whole thing down. No one. Screws with Sinjin. <sighs> Thing is, is, I need to get up in his face before his men actually have it. It's I am the instrument of justice, and I cannot fall. Death has come for you, evildoer, and I am its shroud. Stop talking like that. It is the shroud. It really is. Screw this. Come. Okay. Must be quick. Must be lucky and quick. Weapon. Bread issue. <laughs> I tried. Try that again. I know. You guys are going to get bored of this, aren't you? I'm persistent. <laughs> Ah, speak as a shroud. You shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Let Don't me talk see. to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know you're human. And you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? <sighs> I have cut a path through all your thugs. Who can truly say I'm not the Shroud? Don't listen, man. He's a phony. So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to good neighbor. And kill every last worthless bastard there. And burn the whole thing down. No one. Screws with Sinjin. I am the instrument of justice, and I cannot fall. Death has come for you, evildoer, and I am its shroud. Stop talking like that. It is the shroud. Why? It really is. Are you afraid Screw of the voice? Screw this. Coach. Okay. Um. Need that. And. <clears throat> yeah, the whole getting here without that's how am I supposed to save him? Seriously. Maybe I'm not supposed to, really.
I could just try this. So here, so that, do this, come over here. I have to kill more of them, but I will kill him first, maybe. <laughs> Never been so happy to see anyone in my entire life. I worked. <sighs> hmm. You okay? You all right. My leg is killing me, but it could have been so much worse. I just give up on all of it. Crime fighting just isn't what I thought it'd be. <laughs> it's not quite what you think. Really? After all this, you're just giving up? I knew it was bad out there. But this? I don't even think the Silver Shroud himself could fix this disaster area. <sighs> if you just quit, then the bad guys have already won. You... you're right. I know I'm, I'm tired. I just want to go home. I'm going back to Good Neighbor. Really, thanks for saving me, but I'm just done. Well, that's a choice. Um, it's okay. Not like I can force you to, you know, do something. Combat armor, left leg. Hey, got a left leg piece for him. Wherever McGreedy happens to be. Killed four men and one round of drugs. <laughs> Uh I just need time to recover, you know? Kent. I just need time to recover, you know? Good grief, I'm carrying too much. Uh, extinguishers are fire. Feather duster, cloth and plastic. Okay. Well, that's just that. Need time to recover, you know. Okay. Ah. Uh. no prisoners. I don't know. Do I have to really go all the way through the hospital again? That's kind of... Grr. Should be a... Another exit around here I just somewhere. need time to recover. Yeah, I got that. I heard ya. I don't see any other exits, so elevator it is. Yeah, go ahead and recover.
know, you could have been helpful. I had to kill all four of them, because you didn't do upcus. Go see Hancock, huh? Not difficult. We can definitely do that. And we are way out here, so... Yeah. I'm gonna head back to Jamaica Plain. What we got over here? Fourteen? Holy crap. Fourteen. That is a lot. We got them connect with you, so oh, that's interesting. Um You guys seriously need beds and everything else, I'd wager. Or the junk. here. Oh, no, no, no. Did you Probably need anything? everything. Well, to be honest, we're a bit short of food. Anything you could do would be appreciated. <sighs> hmm. Bed, defenses, bed. Thirteen people. Oh, yeah. Gotta get this over here. I can easily pop in a few more beds.
And a sword, anyway. Let's see here. More beds. There's the bed. As for defenses... I feel like getting up on top of these things. Got that pretty well covered. Defenses. Put the roof back now. There you go. You got defense 20, 15 beds. Should be good, right? Hey, I'm a greedy. There you are. Has to be on the open road. Good neighbor was starting to wear out. It's welcome. I'm sorry. I know how hard this has been. Ah, it's welcome. What makes you say that? Good neighbor was a good place to look for work, but a crappy place to hang your hat. Let's put it this way: can't get much rest when you're sleeping with one eye open. Still, it was the best place for me to set up shop. Diamond City's goons would have run me out of town, and wandering the Commonwealth alone isn't the brightest plan when you're hard up for caps. That's true. Ah, uh, the money is Cats not worth it. risking your life. Easy for you to say. But right now, I need every cap I can get. Why? Are caps really that important to you? I don't have much of a choice. Uh, I don't usually go around sharing stuff like this, but you've been pretty straight with me, so I'm going to be straight with you. It's those two asshole. <clears throat> Those two idiots you saw me talking to at the third rail. Winlock and Barnes. They've been hounding me for months and it's been driving off clients. No one wants to touch me once they learn I used to run with the gunners. And I figured if I could get enough caps together, maybe I could buy them out. Curious. How many caps do you need? I'm not sure. Honestly, that's not even what concerns me the most. I'm wondering how I'm going to pull it off. 
Winlock and Barnes have a small army of gunners with them at all times. They might decide to just keep the caps and put a bullet in my head for good measure. If I set up a place to meet them, I'm sure they'd roll in with everyone they've got. Unless... Maybe you and I could pay them a little visit and put an end to them before they realize what's going on. Before you get that look on your face, let me just say that I wouldn't even be asking if I didn't trust you. Yeah, we're not just going to go in there and slaughter them because you owe them a debt. Is there any other way to handle this? If there was, I would have done it already. Mm. To be honest, even if they took the money, there's no guarantee they wouldn't change their minds later. Then I'd be That's completely true. broke and on the run. Can't argue that. Ah, okay, fine. If you need fine. my help, I'm there. Wow, I don't know what to say. Truth is... I haven't been able to rely on anyone since I was a kid. Everyone I've met has either tried to rip me off or plant a knife in my back. But you, you're different. We see eye to eye on almost everything. And I have a funny feeling you actually care about what happens to me. That's why I asked for your help. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna make this easy on you. If you feel like helping me with this, head over to the Mass Pike Interchange and we'll take them down. If you don't, I'm not going to hold it against you. Either way, thanks for hearing me out. It's nice to know that you care. Hmm. Think about that. Hey. Need something? Uh. Okay. Talk now. Leave it at that. Um, let's go all the way back to Good Neighbor. Talk to Hancock. Fault suit, huh? I like it. Has its advantages. I think Whitechapel Charlie's got some work if you're looking. He's down in the third rail. Not really looking for work. I just need time to recover, you know? Too bad about Finn. Gonna miss him next Super Mutant attack rolls round. Oh well. What can I do for our newcomer? Uh. What's your, What's your story? story, Hancock? My favorite subject. I came into this town about a decade ago. Had a smooth set of skin back then. While I was busy making myself a pillar of this community, I would go on these, like, wild tears. I was young. Any chems I could find, the more exotic, the better. Finally found this experimental radiation drug. Only one of its kind left, and only one hit. Oh man, the high was so worth it. Yeah, I'm living with the side effects, but hey, what's not to love about immortality? Uh, curious. You're immortal? Well, not exactly. Ghouls just age really, really slow. Something about the rads, maybe? Oh, who knows? 
That's cool. You're a hell of a risk taker, Hancock. Only have one life. Why not try it all? Anyway, did you need something else? Mm, no. Nothing right now. Cool, cool. I just need time to recover, you know? Uh, I'm gonna come over here and uh, change. Just uh, don't... Don't lurk behind the mirror. You ever try chess? Sometimes you need to sacrifice a piece to keep the game going. Keep that in mind. Always do. The Best deed is, the is done. The dreaded Sinjin breathes no more. All by your lonesome, you took down the big bad Sinjin. We I just need time that to recover. Rope of freedom you know? one more day. Take this for the effort. Well, that's a bit of change. You played your part in serving justice to those most deserving of it. I'm gonna miss these little conversations. Aren't we, though? Ken, my man. Why the long face? You got what you wanted. I was t tortured. Almost died. It's not like the radio plays at all. Hey, who hasn't been tortured from time to time? The price of throwing down with the man is always a few scars. Pick yourself up. Good neighbors just a bit safer thanks to the two of you. Hmm. What would the Shroud be without his faithful friend, Red Reinhardt? This... this means a lot to me. I'm gonna need some time to heal, you know? But then I got a special project in mind, just for you. I'll fire uh, up my radio station if I make any progress. Okay. Uh, that's cool. Alright. We're out of here. We didn't get to the top of this town by playing it fair. No, you probably did not. Holy moly. The silver shroud in the flesh. Oh no! Death is coming for me! <laughs> Well, if I'm bored. Hmm. That's pretty much all that is. Neighbors into I think these loading screens just take longer and longer and longer. Still shorter than me actually running all the way there. Raider Trouble at Finch Farm completed. Didn't know we had Raider Trouble at Finch Farms. Finch Farms. Wait. 
Those are just the talk to Western ones. I'm not mistaken, going off. Yeah, I think that's pretty much what that is. That's cool. Every time I end up talking to Preston, I end up getting more and more and more and more. It's a bit annoying, to be honest. Well, could really use a drink. Hey there, you happen to know how to make a dirty warhead? No. What's in it? Let's we'll start with some Nuka Cola Quantum, add some vodka, whiskey, and gin. Shake it and finish with a splash of red scorpion venom. Holy crap, that's insane. No, 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 no. Insane would be asking for a double. <laughs> My old man taught me that duct tape could fix anything. Hey, Sturgis. I don't think he was talking about bullet holes. Mm, probably not. Um, yeah. I think we're going to call it here, ladies and gentlemen. Get a good night's rest here and uh, kind of figure out where we're going to go from here. Kind of need to follow some more of the trail for, like, I don't know, the railroad or maybe start looking for the Institute a little bit more hardcore. Um, helping out uh, good neighbors. Kind of fun. But, uh, yeah, I don't see that leading to the path to find my son, and that's kind of the thing that this is all about. So, there's there's that. Kind of cool that I've got a pretty decent network going on, though. And uh, supply should be forth-flowing. You know, I definitely have funds to buy it if I need to, but, yeah. But anyway, this is Mark, the guy at play, signing out. I will catch you guys for the next one. Oop. Let's hit the save, shall we? Yeah, that's a save. Good idea. Alright, guys. Have a good one. See you next time.